The former waste collection contractor for St. Landry Parish is speaking out after being accused of not taking care of customers. News 10 Zane Hogue finds out how Waste Connections is prepared to take legal action for these accusations. Following new garbage contracts creating a delay in service across St. Landry Parish, Waste Connections is responding to comments made about their company. Um, one of the comments made was that we left trash down for two to three weeks, and that's inaccurate. Um, we even pulled our tonnages from the trucks that dump, and uh, I was out in the field. We ran two extra trucks during that week to make sure that we picked up all the trash because we wanted to leave the parish in a, as good a state or better than when we took it over. Following several comments made about waste connections, Gilbert says a cease and desist letter has been issued to St. Landry Parish Solid Waste. It got aired up, up the food, up the chain with our corporation. Uh, they said, you know, this is enough. So yes, we did have a cease and assist uh, letter sent out. Uh, for anything that be, could be considered defamatory, you know, any defamation or, you know, slander or anything like that, that's you know just not truthful. Gilbert says the cease and desist is an effort to prevent further inaccurate information from tarnishing the company. Yeah, you know, it could tarnish our reputation because we do service Acadiana, all the other parishes around here also. And so we want to be clear because, you know, we are prideful of the service that we provide. We, we were part of this parish for 15 years and uh, we did the best we could. I even ran extra trucks, which cost us money, but I ran extra trucks to ensure that the garbage was coming up every day. Gilbert says it's up to Waste Connections attorneys to decide if legal actions will be taken further. For KLFY News 10, I'm Zane Hogue.